Hi there, my name is Sean McConaughey, and today my group would like to teach you all about how to manage stress. Emotional stress is a part of everyday life. We experience it in work, school, personal relationships, and much more. It is an unavoidable part of our day to day. It is even pointed out by experts that stress is a necessity because it drives us to work through life's difficulties instead of simply avoiding them. However, there is a need to find healthy coping mechanisms for releasing our daily stress, and our group is here to help. Today we will be demonstrating several healthy coping mechanisms you can make a part of your daily life. But first, I'd like to briefly go over what stress is, the effects it has on us, and the risks associated with unhealthy coping mechanisms. The American Psychological Association defines stress as the feeling of being overwhelmed, worried, or run down. It can be fear of uncertainties in our personal relationships. It can be the pressure to do well in work and school. A stress that is well managed serves as a stimulation to do well in our daily lives. But poorly managed stress can bring on many health concerns. It can lead to anxiety, insomnia, muscle pain, high blood pressure, and a weakened immune system. In my personal experience, I was diagnosed with post-traumatic stress disorder several years ago, stemming from my experience of being paralyzed at the age of 21. I found out in a health assessment that I was living with an elevated heart rate all day, every day, and the doctor pointed out that if I failed to find healthy coping mechanisms, I would experience heart disease in my mid to late 30s. So my quest for healthy coping mechanisms began that day. Failure to find healthy coping mechanisms drives many people into unhealthy coping mechanisms. These can be drugs, alcohol, gambling, and aggressive behavior. We've all known someone who in the cars has an overwhelming amount of road rage, and that person likely doesn't have healthy coping mechanisms to deal with their daily stress. All of these come with long-term risks. Whether it's health concerns from drugs and alcohol, whether it's legal problems, or whether it's strained relationships from our aggressive behavior, all of these lead to an unhappy future. Finding healthy coping mechanisms will lead you to a happier life, a more productive career, and more loving relationships. These healthy habits can be art, exercise, reading, writing, and much more. With stress defined and the need for healthy coping mechanisms explained, we'd like to share with you some methods you can begin using today. First up, I'd like to introduce you to Lynn, who's going to teach us about how she manages stress with meditation and mindfulness.